Okay. We can get started. Alright, so we do have the sage burn. Um Holy oh, Spirit and the best of graces we do, you know. We do ask that all messages as far as higher self. <laughs> Even when it is spicy. We ask that all negative entities are forbidden. So, um, I already was getting like beginning to get closed, like drained, like like thrown around and just gripped up and okay. Sorry, spirit. It's like something being taken. Look, ace of cups. Um Mm, I, like you're gonna be falling all over the place, like falling into the house. What's this? Queen of Pentacles. Like y'all gonna be falling all over the place and into the house and hang me in reverse. Like it's no letting go. It's like the like the floodgates open everything. Okay, so y'all. The seven of pentacles like every like you see no holding back basically is what i'm getting then we got the sun okay spirit how do you want the sun to come out up oh, right so the sun did come out um in the full see okay cool so these actually came out um earlier so this energy like th like okay so this feels like you're gonna be really happy they're gonna be really happy you might be doing things that you've never done with any other person or them or both of you guys and it's just like no holding back like this is like double confirmation of no holding back but like um in a positive way like just being really happy about what you have going on what you're doing like um just feeling real passionate and like like a real commitment like a real genuine commitment investment like this is my person type like so passionate this is my person so like my person gets it all type you know so i'm actually gonna put these like together um let me yeah i mean i have this here right is it gonna it's just gone <laughs> i don't want it to happen okay <clears throat> so you might be a little dramatic But like in a cute way. Then we got the three of swords reverse, the justice card, and the death card. So this is really nice coming out together. Like for this to be your okay, so this is 18 plus spicy. So the the spice here is that all of this passion is not going anywhere. The spice here is you two are being genuine with each other. Like, y'all being genuine about how y'all feel. Y'all really letting y'all hearts open. Y'all really letting y'all souls open. And y'all both um, maybe making a kid um, or making the foundation uh, for a kid to come or for a whole family to come after. Um, or... Um, um, yeah, because even though these is two separate, I feel like mm, two separate entities is coming together and healing. Uh, okay, so I, this is what I'm getting. I feel like you guys are soulmates, okay? But, like, I do believe in twin flames. So I do believe you guys are twin flames, which is one soul that breaks into two. So it's like you both, if it's one soul and it breaks into two, you both have two different life experiences. So what you have in your two different life experiences, you go through heartbreak. And I feel like both of y'all are releasing all your heartbreak with each other, like through love and stuff like that and sex. And I feel like both of you are bringing your creativity, your passion, your foundation together. And... 13 is a four see nine and four is stability but nine is independent stability and four is like foundation so this is like emperor and this is like like empress but like deeper than that because these are like bees and ants this is like the world like uh, like 
just very powerful and creative. Like these might be um, tarot cards that come out for you often. Okay, so the next. High Priestess Reverse and the Two of Pentacles Reverse. Hmm. So you're changing how you look and invest. Okay. Okay, cool. So you're changing how you look and invest. Okay, so I see this is coming out as a spicy reading. In my opinion, this is coming out as a spicy reading because um, changing your whole foundation, changing your security, uh, change, like like um not feeling like you have to move from your intuition like uh feeling like you could go with the flow and stuff like that is not always like you can't do that with another person with other people like it's just not easy all the time or or um um and both of you feel like that but you both are gonna be able to feel like you don't have to juggle that with each other like you're gonna learn boundaries and learn each other and um really be uh, intentional about moving forward. Okay. Then we got the chariot in reverse. So what do we have the chariot in reverse with? The eight of wands, it looks like. not moving forward with <laughs> not moving forward with with um okay with like false contentment is what I'm getting like, you're not feeling like you have to settle for being a different way or acting a certain way to move forward to, to, to your victory, your idea of victory. And as both of you guys, once again, being able to do that, like meet each other in the middle. Um, through passion, a lot of passion, but also through being still and patient with each other. Right, because we got the six of pentacles. That's like equal give and take. <laughs> then we have the king of wands reverse, and and we have the eight of pentacles reverse. So we have the six of pentacles, and we have the king of wands in reverse, and the eight of Excuse me. The eight of pentacles in reverse. So it's not feeling like, <laughs> excuse me. It's not feeling like hard work. It's like, it's equal give and take. That's what's coming in. That's that's what's coming in. Okay. Um, and that's spicy. That's spicy because you might not be used to that. <laughs> Especially with another person. Um, I'm, I'm seeing a lot of balance and you get getting support in ways that you didn't receive it before um, and ways that you uh, have been aware of or that you watch other people but you like didn't receive it um, and then with the king okay let me pull some more cards and then with the king of wands reverse I'm going to actually clarify that so that we could get a deeper understanding and then we could probably go backwards that's what it's feeling like so can i have a clarification for the king of wands and reverse spirit the seven of wands and the two of swords um so this is like conflict so not being passionate about conflict so it seems like both of you are not are not trying to be into like conflict, having the other person confused about things, like 
So that's the spiciness, right? And then we have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Can we clarify this Eight of Pentacles in reverse? Can we clarify this Eight of Pentacles in reverse? Wow, look at that. The Queen, the Queen of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles. So not going with the masculine energy, the 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 this is my kingdom energy, but this is this is the this is the kingdom because with a queen there is a king which you know the king is reversed but we do have the suit here and we have the the pinnacles here we have the king being in reverse which would draw that king into negative energy but then we also clarify the king with the set with the energy that you would see but it's there to say that it's a balance there. It's a it's a fear balance. Like that's in this person, but this person is gonna learn how to. Okay, for okay, so that's in this person, but this person is gonna learn how to balance that out. As the woman or feminine energy here knows how to do that as well, and is not gonna have to put as much effort or put all of the work and effort or uh, um, like just more than the other one you know what i mean like it's it's genuine care in this in this situation right so i think that's beautiful so we're gonna take that back right and then we're gonna clarify some more okay so we're gonna clarify this chariot in reverse so we have the Queen of Cups and the Ace of Cups reverse. So spicy is, it seems like taking love away. So let's see, can we clarify this? Eight of Wands, look at that. Can we, is it a partner? So we have the king of we have the king of wands looking at this queen of wands, queen of cups. So it's like the feminine energy is emotional, and with the cups energy, this is um, a lot of water energy. So the um, the feminine energy is very emotional, and the feminine energy might have taken the energy back. within this person. So with the fool being reverse and the sun being here and me saying what I've been saying, so this person might not be new. This might not be a new person for you um, in your life, um, for you to experience. This might actually be like an ex or just somebody um, that you couldn't like take, like you couldn't feel like, you felt like you couldn't invest in this person. And they understand that, right? Because look, the six of pinnacles and the eight of pinnacles. Um, this is somebody from your past. Um, um, and yeah, they're ready to put the work in. They wanna put the work in. So let's see real spicy right because somebody from your past is coming forward saying that they're ready to put the work in <laughs> and then like you see how we got this the six of uh wands here in reverse like they was unsuccessful with you in the past so is there anything else that you want to say um regarding the six of look look at that the three of the three of cups and the Ten of Pentacles. Um, like y'all came together or y'all worked together um, like in a business or just like y'all work together literally or y'all had some type of plan to come together and work together and it was supposed to be like it may have been other people involved or it may have been other people who was aware of the plans like uh, who seen y'all coming together. And it was unsuccessful. So for some of you, you may have felt embarrassed or it's just embarrassing how it happened. Yeah, because we got the Six of Cups in reverse. So the Six of Pentacles is the give and take. 
So this king, excuse me, because we got the six of cups. Like I said, in reverse. So this king wasn't given an equal give and take with whatever it is y'all was had going on in the past. So would you have that? Right? So now we also let's get more tea. So let's get more tea. So I was saying that I was saying that no more heartbreak, but look, we have you or the feminine energy looking at the heartbreak and the masculine energy looking at, okay, now this is getting funny. Like here's, here's some, some spice. <laughs> okay. Here's, here's, here's some, um, some trigger for spice, okay? In my opinion, right? So we have the king over here, the energy, right? The masculine energy is looking at the 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 energy of the unknown, right? Not only the unknown, but the the lack of um the lack of effort right and this just came out so i'm gonna take it the lack of effort the lack of give and take that has been going on right but i guess they looking at their their um their exact role their exact intuition in it like from their masculine and feminine in uh, energy right um or take it as you may um, this could be one person looking from their feminine energy of uh, their feminine energy is uh, healed and their masculine energy uh, is unstable, right? Okay. Um, While well, I'm looking at the ten, the two of pentacles, which is about juggling, which is about just having a balance, um, and balance has seemed to be a theme of this read. Um, we have the ten of wands and it is actually difficult to read if this ten of wands is upright or if this ten of wands is um reversed what and i don't think that that's a um coincidence um nothing is a coincidence so this has everything to do with like balance um just about the burdens the stability what's being taken on um and what's been taken on and why and um just the role that's been played that's what's being thought about within the masculine energy so if you're thinking about these things then this is you but if you're not thinking about these things and you aren't the reason for things to go wrong then that's what the masculine energy is doing right now and that's spicy if that's not what they were um reflecting you know what i mean yesterday a couple hours ago two weeks ago right so this just came out um and we have the five of swords and it is upright and the five of swords is talking about maybe they won some type of um conflict that you guys had <laughs> uh and they felt good about it in that moment but now they're thinking about like yo i i I either won the one and I created a problem between me and this person and I don't even want this type of problem or I won and bro, I don't even freaking, I won, I let it all go and now I'm sitting here thinking about it. Like I was thinking about it because there's other things like dang, like this person does have a heart and they act like they didn't. So Spirit, what do we have for this death card, what's changing? We got the seven of wands. 
um, the defensiveness, how this person is defensiveness. So that's what the masculine energy is in, defensiveness. So this is like, I guess this is a spicy reading. This, I don't, okay, like, <laughs> this term, term, I feel like I'm reading a relationship. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, defensiveness and like passion. Um, defensiveness and passion. So I'm gonna say, you see how the ma the feminine energy is is looking towards like not heartbreak, just all geared towards not heartbreak. So that's what the masculine energy is thinking about, like how they defensive to the queen of pentacles. This woman is stable, she has her own, she, um, she's balanced, she's fair, she knows how to do, do all that stuff. And she doesn't come with like baggage. She's not here to break the heart. So, They're thinking about how they've been defensive because they haven't been using their intuition. So what do we have for this justice? The seven of wands. Okay, so that was the seven of swords. Okay. Which is, okay. So let's, let's just flip the script. Everything I said is similar, but it's actually doubling down on what I'm saying. So this person is thinking about how, because they don't use their intuition, whether they aren't in tune with their intuition, they are can be fooled in little ways by this woman, this feminine woman that's stable. Um, if they invest, if they invest and put all their like energy and trust into her because she could do this or they've been through that and they don't want it to happen again but that's not the case right and then what do we have for this <clears throat> Then we have the Knight of Clubs. So for this Knight of Clubs, I'm getting the Knight of Wands. It's passion, right? It's about being passionate. What am I getting for this Knight of Wands? Just passion. Like I'm getting freedom and passion. And flow. So that's probably why the masculine energy is like rigid and like nervous. Cause the feminine energy is like free, passionate, but mysterious. Cause I'm over here like, I'm not getting nothing. That's why I like that. It's mysterious, right? Okay, right? And then I already like explained this, but we could do it again, right? All right, all right, spirit. So the full reversed. What do we have for the full reverse? What's spicy about it? The King of Wands. What's spicy about it? The Nine of Wands. That's funny how the Nine of Wands came out later, right? So this person is, this person is 
What's spicy about it? It gotta be something with this nine of wands. The two of wands. They, this person, okay, what's spicy about it? This person is, um, is intentional. But I already said that, right? I told y'all that they was intentional. They want you to feel. When y'all when y'all be in sexual, they're gonna want you to feel like everything. The love, the sadness, everything. So this person might not speak, but they might be the type that show you better than they could tell you. Like I feel like I feel like they're intentional and they just when they put their energy into being intentional is going to take it's going to take you over the moon and it's something in the works. It's something in the works. Right? And then we have the sun. I don't know why I'm getting called to shuffle again. So, what do we have for the sun? What do we have for the sun? What do we have for the sun? The king of pentacles. This is about somebody. This is about the masculine energy taking his time. What? Oh, my gosh. And then we got the, the ten of... The ten of wands the ten of swords with the ten of swords they gotta be something the knight of swords the ten of pentacles I, when I'm over here like it gotta be something okay so I'm feeling like I'm feeling like this person be into like BDSM and uh, this person uh, likes to take their time and they're not yeah because look the nine of the nine of swords came out too so they like to take their time with you and they want you to climax move like over and over and over and they just want to see you happy but they want to put you in like painful they want to do stuff to put you in pain and they want to see you, like, overwhelmed. They want to overwhelm you. Like, they want to see your facial expressions. And they want to make you talk. Like, they want to hear what you say. And when you say stuff and that make them realize the truth, like, they want to, like, have sex with you so that it could come back, like, like y'all could, like, restart. Like, but they want you to know that they are going to put the energy. Like, they want to show you through the sexual experience that they're a new person. <laughs> that they understand. So, so if they freaking you crazy after y'all have, like, an intimate conversation and you talking about being sad, then they not really... <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Spirit so wants you to know that they not really, they don't really grasp it. But if they take their time with you, then they really do feel it. But they're the type of person that's investing. This person is going to invest in you. This person is going to make sure that everything is going right and stuff. And communication is key. But when you are hurt, like, if, like, they're going to really, like, take their time to, like, love your body down and show you that don't go nowhere because it's just a new a new cycle starting which is probably why the sun and the pool came out like together you see what i mean <laughs> like mm -mm, baby it's just a new cycle starting what are you doing uh-huh uh-huh oh what's that i'm loving you tonight you must be your sin you mm -mm, you sin Spending on love, like whatever, whatever it is you used to, yeah, nah, this ain't it. <laughs> All right, what do we have for this hangman? What do we have for this seven of pentacles? Is that all? 
Did that flip? No, it didn't flip. All right, cool. So for the Hangman and the Seven of Pentacles, I'm getting... For the Hangman and the Seven of Pentacles, See, okay, so remember I told you how it's like the hangman and the seven of pentacles, it was like they're investing, but the hangman came out reverse, so it was like they're not like waiting, like they're for sure they're so with the ace of pen that well okay, yes, with the ace of pentacles like coming out underneath the queen, like all this is nice. Okay, cool. This is really nice. So it's saying like they're really invested in you and they are really have a genuine love for you, like to see you grow, um, to to see to 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 invest into you being their queen. Um, I love how a whole bunch of aces come is coming out. The tens keep coming out. It's a lot of love. It's a lot of passion and a lot of investment going on um, in your relationship. Like that's the theme of the relationship. Um, and then we have then we have like that's what they that's what they're looking for. Like the Ace of Pentacles with you. And they come with the, they're investing. Oh my gosh, this is like yin and yang. All of this is like so yin and yang. Like, it's so like real beautiful. It's like real beautiful. So like they're investing and they want like love, genuine love for both of you guys um, um, from the start, from early. So the, you see how it's like, that's a one, that's a one and that's a 10. But then that's a five, so that's like split it. But it's also like the the five of the five of swords to come out underneath with underneath the seven of pentacles. But uh, with the ten of cups, is saying like they want to invest for the long run. They want the happy times and they want the sad times with you, and they're gonna invest in that. And they like that's the goal, and they want you to understand that that's the goal, and and that's what they have. Um, so it's like really, really nice. Like they're not gonna wait. They're not gonna wait. They're gonna keep on going. They're gonna keep on investing in you. They're not gonna hide that. They don't need to hide that from you because that's what's gonna keep y'all going. Cause you are the queen of pinnacles, right? Or I feel like you have the queen of pinnacles. The feminine energy. Like, even if you're the masculine in this situation, you're the queen of pentacles, the feminine energy. So what do we have for this queen of pentacles? What do we have for the queen of pentacles? What do we have for this queen of pentacles? What do we have for the queen of pentacles? Spicy reading, spicy reading. Okay, so we got some fire in this for this, right? So we got the ace of swords. Ace of Cups Reverse and the Ten of Pentacles. And once again, this is like, so the Ace of Swords upright is singing your intuition. Like you already gonna know. So like spiciness, your intuition is smashed sharp. And um, that's gonna be a turn on. Um, because I feel like their intuition is, is, is sharp as well. So that's going to be a turn on. Y'all going to be turned on by intuition without even, like, the investment within each other is what's turning you guys on. The way that y'all invest in each other. Can I get something for this Ace of Cups? Can I get something for this Ace of Cups? Can I get something for this Ace of Cups? Spicy. 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 Okay, cool. So, for the Ace of Cups, spicy, right? Um, so we got the Ten of Wands, and we got the seven. 
of Wands. And we got the Knight of Cups. No, we got the Page. We got the Page of Cups. And we got... The Two of Pentacles. And we have the Nine of Swords. So what's spicy... <laughs> What's spicy is this love is not gonna just be uh, rainbows and sunshines. It's gonna be mental conflict sometimes, but not all the time. It's gonna be more ups and it's gonna be downs, but it's also gotta be a mindset thing. It's gonna have to be give and take, but it's not gonna always be equal give and take. It's gonna have to be a mindset thing. You're gonna have to explain that to each other. It will always be best for you guys to go back and be loving and just remember where it started from and remember and understand that the problems are not just one of yours to have. It is something that both of y'all will share, even if one of you guys are going through it uh, um, personally and the other one doesn't feel it exactly, you still will feel emotions residual from the other person because that's your person. Um, so, you know, sometimes it's gonna be defensive to the other person because y'all still getting to know each other, y'all still invest in each other. Um, um, it's going to come with the time. Um, but always have a mutual outlook and look at both sides of the picture. Um, when you do, um, look at the picture is what I'm getting. So that was really, that was a nice read. <laughs> Thanks for spending your time with me. See you guys in the next one. All right, hey, Pamela 2. So this is your reading. So we are going to figure out your next... So this is a spicy reading. We're going to figure out your next sexual encounter. So we're going to see um, who is going to be with, like, who. Okay, so let's just start off with who is it going to be. <laughs> like, what's the... Okay, Spirit, what's the main energy of this person? What's the energy of this person, Spirit? Um, did you guys come from another time? Okay, so the main, okay, okay. So the main energy of this person is the King of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Queen of Pentacles. This person is stable as crap. And, like, they probably come off as they, as if, if they don't need anyone. Because they are very self-sufficient. Um, very self-sufficient. Like, they have love. They have a lot of self-love, and they just know how to bas um, balance their masculine. And and they wow, they're gonna have you. <laughs> they're gonna have you forgetting your words and stumbling and shit. Okay. Um, and I'm I don't know why, but bucket is is important. I'm gonna just leave these because I'll be I don't know. I'm being called to to put them back. All right. So their prominent energy is stable as as F right okay is there anything uh okay um what's what's pile number two's energy is gonna be like when they run into um this person what's pile number two's energy gonna be like y'all see this stuff just flying out what's pile number two's energy is gonna be like how's pile number two gonna be when they run into this person how's pile number two gonna be when they run into this person this is when you run into this person so we got the Six of Cups, and then we have, did they come out with this one? And that's the Eight of Wands. And then we have the Tower and the Ten of Wands Reverse. Then we got the Four of Wands. And we got, no, we have the Nine of Wands, excuse me. The nine of wands, and you got the king of swords reverse. So your energy, when you run into this person that you're gonna have your next sexual encounter with, your your energy is gonna be like aware, aware because of somebody from your past. Um, this person might be from your past, but it also might be like an experience that you had with somebody else from your past, or somebody that you um, put inside of your past. Um, but it also might be like a family, a family member, 
or you might know that this person is a past life person and it's gonna put like it's gonna make you feel like you don't have to worry when you meet this person um but you but your energy is also gonna be like cold and I think because they come off so like self-sufficient you're gonna come off like self-sufficient too but I feel like they come off more from self-love and you come off more from like a mental state like uh like they're gonna like energetically you can tell that you're pulling your energy away but at the same time like you can also tell like you'll be okay but you could use the situation. That's how I feel. All right, cool. So now that we know how you are gonna be and who this person is gonna be like when they approach you, all right, spirit. So let's get into the sexual experience. All right, I, I feel like it's, it's gonna be real slippery. <clears throat> like somebody might, you might feel like, they might lift you up if you're a feminine. Or if you're a masculine, you might lift them up and they might feel like um, you're gonna drop them. Or you might actually, somebody might accidentally get dropped. I mean, oh my goodness, no. Okay, somebody might accidentally get dropped. But for most cases, some of you is gonna feel like you're gonna get dropped, but you're not gonna get dropped. It's going like they're gonna catch you. But dang, somebody is gonna be a couple seconds too late. <laughs> um, but it's like, does seem like something you're gonna be able to laugh, laugh off. Okay, Spirit, what can we know about the next sexual encounter? Like, the next sexual encounter. It's going to catch you off guard. Then we got the Six of Pentacles in reverse. It wants to be in reverse so bad. It's going to catch you off guard. And not only is it going to catch you off guard, like, you, you're, you're going to feel like you're not following your intuition. Like, um, it's going to be a time where you where it's not equal give and take. Two of Wands. Two of Wands reverse. Yeah, like no direction. Like no direction. Your next sexual encounter is gonna be wild and all over the place. With the eight of cups reverse. You're not going nowhere. I expect to do rounds. The next sexual encounter. The Queen of Pentacles. It's no love. Wow. Okay. I heard it. it's no love. Y'all, y'all gonna be like, wow. Y'all gonna be f fucking. Is what I'm getting. It's gonna be wow, all over the place. With no direction, no leaving, or you're not gonna wanna leave. You're gonna feel so like. This is actually the four. So it's gonna feel like unstable. It's gonna feel like it's not gonna be, um, what? It's gonna feel like it's hot. It's gonna feel unstable. Y'all gonna be all over the place. It's gonna feel like something you're not gonna wanna leave. It's gonna be real passionate. Like I said, y'all gonna be effing. So it's gonna be like intense. It's gonna be strong, like pounding and stuff. Um, it's not gonna like y'all not gonna be loving each other. Y'all gonna be like eating each other up. Next sexual and spirit, uh, spicy next sexual experience. What wants to come out? The Queen of Swords reverse. It's gonna y'all gonna be like disrespecting each other. Some of y'all is into like rough sex. This is gonna be that. It's gonna be a, a real heightened experience. But like. Maybe some of y'all don't realize that y'all into rough sex just how much. Or you're not gonna realize how much you want it. <laughs> or they gon' or, or or you never experienced it or thought you would experience it the way that you wanna experience it. 
but you it's not even something that you it's not something that you thought you could experience as some of you are in a relationship with this person is gonna happen it's not something that you thought you would experience as this person's partner enters the relationship or you left the relationship you it's not something you thought you could experience with the person that you left so, so for some of you this is just like a a one night stand that's like really passionate really fire and a really different experience so that's spicy um because we got a lot of queen energy here um and high priestess so it's like you have a lot of foundation a lot of energy but it's like none of that is being used like all of this is like quick and, and wild and and no words need to be said and give it to me right here right now let's go let's get it let's do it let's get it <laughs> like okay what we have for this high priestess how can we um define this high priestess so we got the five of wands that's um and it's reversed so like you don't want to be you don't want to have no conflict yeah so it's like your intuition is off because you don't want to have any look not investing you feel like like this is not meant to be this is not meant to be something that you invest in so this is spicy this is not meant to be something that you invest in you don't want to use your intuition you just want it to hit and, and keep on moving or that's how they felt or y'all mutually felt this right what do we have for this two of wands right which makes sense because the two of wands come after that like with no direction like nah that's what we're not doing then we got the six of pentacles and once again this could come out like either way so i feel like both of y'all was like yeah we're not really doing nothing we're not really trying to build nothing right your next sexual encounter we're not really trying to nah we already know look the four swords the four swords with the six of swords and the ace of swords which is a 10 which is a completion no direction with the queen of pentacles we're not with the eight of, but the eight of pentacles is reversed so maybe this is like we're not trying to build a a, a relationship a, a big relationship but we might come back to each other or you gonna want that's what's the spice in this y'all gonna wind up coming back to each other because it's so fire and y'all have that understanding it's like it don't make sense for us not to come back to each other you feel what i'm saying um with the four of wands i feel like you're gonna be like resting that's why you're not gonna leave you're not gonna leave because you're gonna feel rested and because y'all feel like y'all not like in uh really trying to put that much into it that's why so, so much is going to come out of it <laughs> so can we get this queen of queen of swords in reverse what are we clarifying this way what are we clarifying the queen of swords in reverse with the queen of wands all right so you're not talking you show me i can show you better than i can tell you the, with the ten of pentacles on top of the Ten of Pentacles on top of the Eight of Cups reverse, the the Queen of Swords reverse, the Four of Swords of like, t t I'm getting, I'm getting reversed and all right, and the Ten of Pentacles. I'm seeing like you just feel comfortable like coming and going as you please, not really having a big commitment. And just being able to, to be passionate and just express yourself and be yourself. And then what we have for the strength? What do we have for the strength? Like really standing in your power as you watch yourself just embrace your sexuality and this other person embrace their sexuality. It's like you it's like y'all get to just come together and do that for you for yourselves and for each other. Then we got the nine of swords. Like being in your head. Yup. Y'all get to be in in, in your own y'all get to be in your own heads and come together at the same time. And that's why it just works for both of y'all. It just everything is just working out. Um but what y'all don't see what's even more spicy and funny is that like it's it could really work. It's gonna it's gonna be working for a while. <laughs> 
<laughs> y'all can really work. Y'all gonna be working for a while. So it's gonna be real nice, real spicy, real passionate, and real fulfilling. I love that it ended like that. And real fulfilling. I love that it ended like that. So, <laughs> real spicy. I'm excited for y'all. Enjoy yourselves. Um, you know, I don't see, I, don't, I didn't see nothing wrong. Spirit didn't say nothing wrong. I didn't feel nothing wrong. So do your thing. Okay, so this person is gonna get you chocolate or you're gonna get them chocolate or you're gonna want chocolate. But there's gonna be a whole bunch of toppings involved. Okay, spirit. So, you might feel like you gotta wait. So you can really enjoy yourself. Or they feel like that. They don't know how to really enjoy themselves. Like by indulging in what they really like or what they really want, they don't know how to enjoy themselves. So how else can we identify this person? How can we identify this person? How can we identify this person? They could fit into the environment. How do we identify this person? How do we identify this person? How do you, how? Okay, so how do we identify this person? How do we identify this person? So I know I said, how do you? And then I said, how do I? And then I said, how do I identify this person? <laughs> so this person like knows how to change. And like get low. <clears throat> All right. Um, it's gonna take some time to get to understand this person. Right? We got the five of cups sideways. Which means this person is like, how you gonna identify this person? How this person appears is like half good, half bad. <laughs> and you don't know if you should walk away or not. Because they're not really like, Financial-wise, they're not really... Okay, financial-wise, you don't know. They don't show all their cards financial-wise, right? And the truth is, they know how to manifest money. They know how to get rid of people that snakes. They know that The way they move is to make sure that it's like a protection, a protection cloak the actions and stuff. Nobody is about to just stick around and 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 um and deal with this person just because they have alternative motives. This person is gonna not invest, not give you support, and not shy away from speaking up when it's time to. Um and they don't feel bad about walking away themselves, but they'll make you feel like you have to. And not you per se, but a person if they if, if, it, if it needs to be. Then we got the six of cups. 
and we got the world so this might be a soulmate uh, from a past life or this might be somebody from your past or your childhood and the world is really feeling like like a past life um, but the world is really I feel like this life um, and for some of you it might have been past life and this life or okay so for some of you it might have been past life for a lot of you it's past life and this life but for like the majority of you is a this life a soulmate from this life and the three of cups in reverse like you, you, you guys haven't been together that's how you identify this person Or they come off as if like their heart, see the moon when I split the deck, they come off as if like their heart is not, is not, um, like they never got hurt, broken hearted. <clears throat> their heart can't get hurt. That's how they come off. Okay, cool. But they, that's because, you know what I mean? Like they have takes one to know one type shit okay what energy are you gonna be in how three when this person comes around what energy is power three gonna be in real stable energy what kind of energy is power three gonna be in when this person come around spicy i just gotta say spicy spicy what kind of energy is power three gonna be in and when this person comes around. Oh. oh, you're a magician too, huh? All right. Okay, so you guys are mirroring each other. <laughs> All right, so what kind of energy are you going to be in, pal, too? So we got the emperor. You're going to be in a stable energy. You're going to be in an energy where you're leading yourself. You're the leader of the pack. You're, you know what I mean? You're leading other people. You may have a family of your own. You're going to be in a masculine energy. And then we have the six of wands, like, but a victorious energy. Like, whatever it is, your routines and stuff, they flow right for you. They go well. This is the energy that you're going to be in. Okay, cool. So the energy you in, okay, so you're going to surprise them because you aren't like, first of all, your energy is like that, off rip, you come off very stable, right? And you come off like, you're ready to move forward, you know how to move forward, you have stability, um, you, you have support, like, you, you know what's going on. It's going to catch them off guard because your energy is also going to be like, you're moving forward but you're not taking foolish or making foolish decisions so um your energy is giving like f with me and find out and then we got the hermit in reverse so you are not gonna be um hesitant about expressing yourself or anything like that and that's gonna catch people off, off guard because you already come off so like stern you or so put together and you shouldn't have to express yourself um kind of so if somebody does try you they'll be like dang like maybe there'll be a pushover but you come off like um no like you tried me and i actually thought about this like you come off like um you have everything put together so uh things shouldn't go wrong but then you surprise people um by letting them know like no when things go wrong for people who plan for stuff like this i plan for people like you <laughs> right because the magician comes out after it right under the six of wands and right beside the emperor so it's like come on and then what's next the the fool in reverse mess with me and find out because we're gonna keep on going because what's underneath the fool in reverse the queen of cups upright it's like you love what you do you love who you are you love who you're surrounded by you love moving forward you love making decisions and then we got the ace of swords in reverse like you don't really have to say much you see how the eyes is there the eyes is there it's like the magician is here and the eyes is here and um the wands like you're very passionate but the swords is here like you can say stuff but you don't really need to say stuff the hierophant came out i believe that this came out together so we're gonna say the hierophant 
Um, and then we got the three of cups in reverse. So I'm going to take them all together. Um, but I don't even need to. But this is just like your energy is very strong um, when this person comes in. So what I'm going to do is just take this and put this up here so that I can lay these out. Because this is very beautiful energy. Even though I want that magician to be right there, I do. It's like, it's like, it's like, it don't even, it only, I don't even mind the magician being up there. Because what, what else we have is, um, is, is just beautiful. It just all goes together. Like, it's no getting out of the direction of your energy. And I, you know what I mean? It's no getting so you you see how i just did that like that's how you come you come off like you already got it together but then people deal with you and then you trust yourself and then you surprise people as well it's no like it's no going in another direction if it does not make bro it's the synchronicities for me like you probably are also a person who has synchronicities all the time like we got the fool and then we got the five and the five is about changes right and the fool is a zero. The fool is reverse and the hierophant is, is in reverse. I mean, what was I just talking about? If it's not a direction, if it does not make sense, if it's not sub stability for me and mine, or the, you know what I mean? If it don't like make sense, it's not happening. The hierophant, if it's unknown, it's not going on. And we're not moving forward with it. Everything just aligns, right? Then we got the then we got the three of cups reverse. So you also have been through some type of heartbreak, some type of pain. Um, and you, so first of all, I'm getting, this is spicy because you're matching energy. And you probably haven't met somebody who matched your energy in a, like this. Um, so um, the, three of, um, the three of cups in reverse. So it's like, you're not even about to get your heart broken or like, you're not afraid to speak about it. You're not afraid to speak up and say, we're like, um, things that you don't like and then we also have the lovers in reverse um with the ma underneath the magician so you're not afraid to make decisions but you're also not afraid to not make decisions or not or like go with decisions that that's not for you and then we have the strength card underneath the queen which is really really beautiful because that to me is saying like you stand in your power and you're strong and like look at all the colonies and animals that surrounded her it's just like she looked like that magician and and just like you 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 put in hard work and due diligence to be the queen of cups um the magician uh, to stand in your power and to have that emperor energy so you are very balanced like you have a good balance of masculine and feminine energy like you don't play all right so can we clarify oh okay no we're not clarifying this so that's who you are so that's nice that's real that was kind of spicy um spicy who are you and who are they so now we're gonna do a spicy how is the sex gonna be because that's probably what you're wondering right we already seen the energy you guys are gonna be when you meet each other real nice energy spicy energy for t uh, society's day and age if you ask me um you know comment below and let me know what you think um okay spirit so chili garlic sauce how is the sex gonna be spicy sex gonna be how is the sex gonna be spicy how is the sex gonna be how's the sex gonna be spicy how's the sex gonna be how's the sex gonna be spicy how's the sex gonna be <coughs> how's the sex gonna be spicy you gonna lose your breath so how's the sex gonna be spicy how's the sex gonna be How's the sex gonna be spicy? How's the sex gonna be? How's the sex gonna be spicy? How's the sex gonna be? 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 How's the sex gonna be spicy? How's the sex gonna be? How's the sex gonna be spicy? How's the sex gonna be? How's the sex gonna be? Y'all know those songs, those early 2000 songs that like be like the man and the woman is like singing and like they going back and forth like y'all matching each other energy texture like i'm getting ashanti and jaru you know how they finally came together <laughs> like what that's how i'm getting like y'all some real fiery people y'all speak up for y'all y'all hold y'all own fourth down and then y'all coming together to have some fire sex bro Fire everything because y'all already is fire. 
right? So we got the wheel. The sex is gonna be different. Like, whatever you used to, I feel like things is gonna change. Like, y'all gonna change each other's. Then we got the judgment. What did I say? So I like it's gonna ch- y'all gonna change each other because y'all gonna trust each other. Y'all gonna be trying new things, and y'all gonna be eating. Then we got the Ace of Pentacles. Y'all gonna really invest in each other and treat each other real nice and gentle, like and take your time with each other and like and take your time to explain. But also, the, not only is the person that's gonna be like, woo, taking their time to explain, but it's gonna be the person there yeah, receiving it. Oh my God, the 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 the. the. The the, <laughs> the 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 cycle, you guys are just gonna feel so good back and forth. Y'all gonna be so happy. Then we got the King of Cups in reverse, and that feels like the masculine energy is gonna be like like down. Which is not a problem in this situation because y'all both gonna be giving to each other. And masculine, like, if y'all both already come off of, like, y'all the shit and stuff like that, then you know what I mean? Somebody gonna have to dumb themselves down a little bit. But the fact that y'all both investing in each other, like, like, he just gonna, you know what I mean? He gonna be daddy, but, like, you gonna, oh, that's what I'm getting. He gonna be daddy, but you gonna be his, his baby, his baby girl. Okay. Then we got the Six of Swords and the Ace of Swords reverse. So you're going to be moving to less communication. Not having to communicate. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Because we read in spicy and energy, right? He gonna treat you like his baby girl. But the masculine energy here might be into being submissive. Being the one that's being submissive. So you're gonna move to talking crazy. Like, the feminine energy, I feel like, is gonna be head honcho in the bedroom. That's what's spicy. I feel like it's the feminine and okay, so I feel like in a world the masculine energy and the feminine energy is like equal. <laughs> but behind closed doors, like the feminine energy is the one who is like the the master and the um the um Cause look, the queen too. The queen, the aunt of the colony. Like the queen is the one who sleep with all the ants. <laughs> Keep everything going, got everything together. Off with his head if he has to. Like you know what I mean? She's head honcho. Um. So it also might be the feminine's idea to to like lead towards this. Um, <laughs> and it might lead to y'all not talking. So that's spicy. But we about to clarify this, right? But if y'all not talking, look, it's because y'all loving the king of, because I'm, look, the, I didn't even shuffle it out. This shuffled out with it. Y'all not talking because he is loving it. Like, it's giving, like, you're the master, <laughs> okay? <laughs> You're the master, okay? You are the piece. You don't need to say nothing. Cause you don't need to say nothing. So yeah, y'all not having to talk about things. All right, can we clarify the wheel? Spicy, what's up with the sex? What's gonna be going on? Four cups, very st- stable, stability. Can we clarify this judgment card? clarify this judgment card it's going to be secure so the feminine energy is going to be the leader it's 
It's gonna be nudable for you guys because this masculine is not used to being so in charge and this feminine is also not used to being like in this role. So it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be spicy. But you see how the jack is a, is a jack? The, the, like, okay, so what's going on in this investment, this four of cups? Wait, nope, cause the four, wow, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So the Four of Cups is about um, not recognizing. So, re like not recognizing. The feminine, like this might not be a relationship that you guys are um, trying to be in, committed. So y'all might be seeing other people. But it's like the masculine might not be seeing other people is what I'm trying to say. Like the masculine might just be emotionally unavailable. But they are emotional when it comes to the queen, the queen of pinnacles, like the queen of pinnacles and the jack of pinnacles. Although they are not the um, the suit that you might like go for, it's a suit. So he might not, the masculine energy in this, in this situation, the spice here is a masculine energy might not feel like or might not even be on the same level as the feminine energy in this relationship and this in the stability here, but that's what's stable here. So, you know, each of them has their own stability type, basically. But the judgment here is like them acknowledging that and moving forward. The spiciness. Look, then we got the three of wands. Is there anything that's going to come out with the three of wands? The three of wands is about figuring it out, working. So they working together. I feel like it came out reversed. So they working together to 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 be passionate, but. The um the woman is more the woman is more stable. The woman is the eight of swords. She don't want to do all this. That's the spice. It seemed like... It seemed like... Y'all mixing it together. And... Um, it just like y'all. It feels stuck, or she feels stuck. Y'all feel stuck. That's the spice. Like what's going on right now is not coincidence. This is what's happening. This is <laughs> great. Okay, cool. So can we clarify? See, look at this. It's like. Oh, that was it? It's like moving forward. <laughs> it's moving forward, but it's the male. The male is, is like, is really, the male is really um, into her and he's real clingy, right? The masculine. And the feminine energy is cold and sharp. But y'all balance each other out. But also, it's like words. I'm telling you, like, it's giving, like, sex slave type stuff. Like, or it could be, like, cougar. 
But it, it is like. Healing is healing because both have been on both sides of the coin in some way, right? So that's spicy. Both have been on both sides of the coin. S sauce, right? Okay. So sauce is important. Because sauce is important because it's different. It's just gonna resonate for whoever that resonates with. I'm not really being told like more of that, but like when it resonates, it's gonna be like an aha moment. Then we got the six of, six of swords and the ace of swords reverse. So can we clarify that? Can we have something for the Six of Swords and Ace of Swords? Okay. So this is going to be revealed to you. Wow, I was just talking about healing. That's really cool, right? Um, and then the Six of Pentacles. Ooh, excuse me. Okay, so you're moving towards less heartbreak, not really having to talk about it. And then we got the Six of Pentacles, and that's for, like, both of you guys, I'm feeling like. So with the Six of Pentacles, like, for both of you guys, it's feeling like, um, like, y'all not really gonna have to talk. Like, y'all gonna be able to heal. Okay, so the sex is gonna be, like, healing, and it's gonna be like you knew each other's bodies before. And... You're not really gonna have to talk. Like, y'all just gonna have, know how to touch each other and stuff like that. And all of the experience that y'all have is just gonna be healing each other. And the judgment turned upright and it's gonna look at the will. And y'all just gonna realize that y'all meant to build a foundation together and a community and all of that stuff. And that y'all can invest in each other. And that y'all should invest in each other. And that y'all will invest in each other. But also, it just might be like, you know what I mean? So this person was, is like, with the love and the sex, with the sex, it's just not gonna be like about love and passion. Like, y'all gonna be destroying each other in a good way. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. All right, y'all, if you chose this this right here, you're gonna be, you're gonna be changing rooms. You're gonna be getting real buck wow. All right? Um, like pressure. <laughs> All right, so this is the 18 plus reading. Um, it's supposed, it's spicy. It's gonna be a real spicy reading. All right, we're going to find out your next sexual encounter and just the person, how you're going to be feeling. Like, it's just going to be spicy, spicy energy. You know what I mean? Lit, 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 lit. So some of you might be lit. I think it's a song like that. Lit, 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 right? All right. All right, spirit. So what do we need to know about the next sexual encounter? Just what do we need to know? All right, we got the King of Pentacles. We got somebody that's stable, got they sh money together. We got the Five of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody that seems like they dependable, right? And then we got the High Priestess, but you don't really know, right? Or um, if they are, yeah, you don't really know, right? But we talking about the situation? Or are we talking about the sex? Because if we talking about the sex, right? We talking about somebody that's gonna make you feel so secure in the bedroom. Somebody that's real masculine with they shit. Somebody that's gonna make they make you feel like they own your body. When I say own your body, I mean they gonna be on every part of your body, and no parts of your body is gonna get left out. Okay? They not gonna forget any inch of your body. Like they licking toenails fingernails 
They looking behind your ear, the crease of your ear. They will kiss your eyeball. Do you hear what I'm saying? Like, if they giving you, you guys, if they, listen, if she's giving you, what you call it? She's going all the way to, <laughs> she's going all the way to, to like, your pubes. Or, you know what I mean? Like, she getting a gooch too. Like, <laughs> if it's a female, like, she, like, <laughs> she, like, um, what's she doing? What's she doing? What's she, oh, what's he doing? What's he, okay, some of y'all, it might be, it might be something you never did before. Like, this relationship, this experience. And it might be more than one person involved in this situation, right? Um, the masculine might have set the situation up, right? Uh, one of the people might be his ex, and then the other person is just somebody that doesn't really know him that well, but he got her involved, right? We got the seven of pentacles, but he seems secure, right? So that's why you don't really know. Like, that's, that goes along with what I was saying earlier. <laughs> um... Okay, okay. This is spicy. Um, and then we have the five of pinnacles reverse under the five of pinnacles reverse. Okay. So I mean like, you know, that's that's pretty solid energy. Like this is a stable person. Like you could invest in this person. Um but like I'm saying, right? We need one more. Like I'm saying though, right? This person is not going to have you feeling like they're going to be on parts of your body that sh you got to, yo, some people got to, some people need the reminder. You know what I mean? Like, you know, this, you, do you watch this part of your body when you get in the shower? Some people need to be reminded. The way they do your body lets you know that they don't need to be reminded because they think you're that part of their body. So they're going to be expecting you to remember. You understand? Two of cups. You see what I mean? Decisions, choices, stability though, commitments, choices. Even though this is the two of cups, I'm feeling like the lovers. So I definitely do feel like it's some type of commitment. So we have the ten of wands, which is coming out with the ten of cups. So I, you see what I mean? I feel like it's decisions. And then we have the six of pentacles and then we got the give and take and we got the queen of cups and then we got the three of cups. So you see what I mean when I say, <laughs> it seems like it's going to be more than one person involved. It seems like it's going to be a very stable man. Look, and then we got the four of swords is about rest. It's going to be a very stable man. Then it's just going to be these two females. That's, but it's like, yo, He's not going, he like, yo, it's not going to be hard for him to make love to both of y'all. Not at all. He not new to this. He not in his head about it. He don't got no problems about it. You see how this is the, all right, this is the three of swords reverse. So once again, it feels like it's three people coming together, but it seems like the two feminine energies is like, see, we got the queen of cups and we got the, the queen of swords. It's like, but okay. So as funny as it is, the queen of cups might be the person, <laughs> the queen of cups might be the person who, um, is from the past. And the the five of pentacles person is the person that's new. Um, but you're gonna be like, but you both like come together because of this because of this person. And like y'all both have some type of what are that bro? I can't be make yo, y'all both come together for this person. So that's that's real spicy. Um but what I'm getting between y'all is y'all have some type of intimacy, too. Like, y'all gonna enjoy it. Two of Pentacles. Then I, I said y'all got some type of intimacy, too. Y'all gonna enjoy it. What? This might be one of y'all first times doing this with each other. Seven of Cups. 
Yeah, this might be one of your first times doing this with each other or with like females in general. Or you might not even thought that was for you. Three of Pentacles working together. Yeah, you might not have thought that was for you to be working and putting your energy into all that. Like you might, you give main character and main character energy, right? But we got this page of cups. Yeah, like you, why would I invest in that when I'm the whole, like what the hell? We're not doing all that back and forth stuff, baby. You going to do this. But y'all going to find out. First of all, y'all about to be going back and forth with each other. And then this dude's about to come in and tell y'all, did you forget about me? Because that's not what's going to happen. And just blow y'all the hell away. Oh, y'all just going to be working together, just loving each other down. And like I said, the dude is not his first time. So, yo, you know? And if something either I'm getting one of the females may have experienced... For well, a minimum, both of the females might have experience. But that's exciting. That sounds real exciting. Right? Mm-hmm. Nice investment. Something that you feel like you're going to want to invest in. Or something that you're going to feel like you're going to want to do again. Y'all going to want to do that again. Y'all going to want to do that again. Let me see. Tell me more about Tell me more about the three people. Who who's these three people? The King of Swords. Somebody this is somebody that's already probably speaking. Then we got the Ten of Wands in reverse. Somebody who just released something that's giving that five of pentacles person. And then the high priestess in reverse. Look, all three of y'all just did this again. This is the five of pentacles person. Uh, yeah. In reverse. They like they not holding on to like grief, pain, hurt. Look, the six of wands, celebration, y'all all coming together. This is like the, the energy, the overall energy. So y'all all coming together. Like y'all all just see. Look, chariot. Y'all all just see that y'all don't have nothing to lose. Y'all all just see that with each other. So y'all just going to come together for a good old time. So that sounds nice. Y'all see, I don't have nothing to lose. I seen a queen in reverse, a queen of swords in reverse, and a knight of swords, and the three of wands. So somebody might have been moving away or moving to, somebody might be visiting, right? The king of wands in reverse. The King of Wands in reverse. So the so the male energy, the, the masculine energy is is talking, but not but not really show. Oh, okay, okay. They're saying all of this stuff. I feel like they might not they might not be showing showing what they're saying. They, or they just might be able to type of person that, like, um, like, they act two different ways. Like, in the bedroom, they act a certain way. But in public, like, you would never expect that they, that they like that. Right? Then we got this, um, this Five of Pentacles person. And we got the Ace of, wow. And then we got the Ace of Wands. But it came out reverse. And then I say... I think the five, five of Pentacles person was looking this way, and then this person was looking this way. This person might have been from the past, but this came out reverse. So that's probably why. So this person that's not from the past,
Or this person could have been from the past. It could be both, right? This person is just not really trying to take it that serious. Either way, the person that's really close to this person, that knows this person, wants another chance with this person, but they aren't letting it on. But they're just showing like they're not really like trying to be stressing. They're not stressing, they free. But they do have value in this person. You can see that. You can definitely see that. So you are either them or you're going to see that in them, right? So tell me about this moon, which is the high priestess in reverse. So this is the person that knows, but still still over here knowing it and letting on like they know. So this person knows way more. So if you're the person who is, is wanting more, this person knows that, but they acting like they don't. Now, if you're not that person, then you know that and you're doing a very great job of acting like you don't. Two of Cups. Because you also seem like you may want to be with the king. Unless y'all want to be like a group couple. I don't know what the hell is going on. So both of y'all might want the same thing. Or you may openly want this person. So for some of you guys, this these two people are together. And y'all bringing this person into the situation. Which is why this person is looking at you. And he's looking at y'all. And it's like a pleasant surprise, you know what I mean? Like, okay, so you're going to take care of me. We're going to take care of all that. But with this two of cups right here, this person here may be acting like they don't know and stuff and trying to just be being patient about things because they want this woman too. Like, both, of, like the women could be with the men or just the, the women could be together because y'all just... Like, if you really think about it, when I first pulled the cards and stuff, the woman was the ones looking at each other. So this woman may be wanting this man. This is spicy as hell. This woman may be wanting this man, but this woman wants the woman. Right? Is there anything else you want to say about the King of Cups? Spicy reading. The devil. I feel like it was something else that might have wanted to come out in this. Mm -hmm. What did I say? The devil. And the four of swords. I mean, four of wands. Stability. This person is so content with themselves. But then I say in the beginning, like, this person is stable. Like, if this person is stable, then, like, you know what I mean? The, but... I mean, they're stable. They have found stability with within their toxicity as well, though. If you if you if you can understand that, which more than likely you understand that, because like I'm feeling that you're this person. I'm definitely feeling like you're that person. All right. So, what else do you want to tell me about this middle person? The Ten of Swords Upright. Yeah, you see what I mean? Like, this person had the Five of Pentacles uh, reversed. Then they had the Ten of Wands in reverse. And then they got the Ace of Wands in reverse. It's just like, this person comes off like, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to stress. Look, with the two of swords, I'm not going to stress. I don't want to be stressed, da, da 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 But, like, they just seem like they always in their head. Like, they seem very directional, but they always seem like they're in their head. If they're not doing something specific, they're in their head. I don't know why Spirit wants you to know all this. Because this is either you or this is that person. But if it's that person... And you're that other person, then you're interested in them. So spirit wants you to know what you need to know about them, right? So we got the world. Things are changing in this person's life at the moment, right? Or they're conflicted about what's to change. So they're holding themselves in this energy of like non quote unquote nonchalance. But it doesn't really come off as nonchalance. It might come off as soaking a little bit. Then we got the the star. So their life. And then we got <clears throat> the four of pentacles in reverse. Stability. Their life has changed. Like they may have had more stability in their life. Oh my goodness. Jeez. 
This, they definitely had more stability in their life at some point. Somebody has come in and taken their light away. And that's why, that's just, just spicy as fuck. That's what the tea is. Somebody came in and took their life away, took their stability away, changed their whole life, and made them depend on whatever it is, it, on them. Hmm. And broke their heart. They broke their heart. Somebody came in and took their stability. They took their light, right? This person still tried to stand in their power. Instead of leaving... So remember when I said this person might have been with this person and this person, or I said this person might have been with this person. <sighs> How I said it is accurate, but it still might be this person might have been with this person. This person looked into this because this person brought this person into it. But this person seeing everything that's happening makes this person want to be with this person because this person can see how this person bring bring this person down, bringing all these people into it. So this person might've been attracted to this person at first, but now this person wants to save this person, right? Or that's some people have put themselves in, this is spicy. Some Yo, cause if this is you, you about to be like, wow, my vagina is really wet for this person. Some. For some of you, this person put themselves in this position because they already knew everything that was going on in this situation. So, let me get back to this, right? So, this person is being strong, decide not to leave. So, they take on a mental conflict, right? Of just enduring this relationship and basically becoming dull in this relationship. Um, they don't receive their justice because they don't leave. And then they end up brokenhearted. Ground themselves with the king of, of pentacles, which was this person, when I first pulled the spread, right? Real spicy, right? So this is about somebody, like, people having threesomes and stuff. So you either getting into this, or you've gotten out of that, or you're involved in this. If that's not your case, then maybe you know about it. But if that's also not your case, this is not your spicy reading. <laughs> um, okay, so then we have the king of pentacles, which is like, a whole foundation, stability. This is the person who's in charge. Because remember, in the beginning, we was talking about how this person was the one who was so stable. This is crazy. Insane. Has peace. That shit, This person did all this so this person can have peace. So this person is now trying to find a peace back, basically. And they probably are, are so calm, cool, and collective because this person tends to them. Right? Cause they got they broken, they got they heartbroken, aspirations dealt, dead, all of this type of stuff dealt with, and they still somehow find temperance, find peace, find give and take with this King of Pentacles. How? Tell us more. Tell us more about this person who knows. What's up with this person who knows? more about this person who knows tell me more about this person who knows because then I'm also going to read this as dumb sexually so just give me a second tell us more about the person who knows is that it Tell us more about the person who knows. Is that it? All right. All right. This person who knows. So this person I was saying they seen right and they wanted to move forward. So then we got the the ace came out, but I thought it came out. All right, we just gonna take it. All right, so we got the Ace of Pentacles. So as I said, the Two of Cups and Ace of Pentacles, they definitely want something with the feminine energy in this situation, right? Then we got the Six of Cups in reverse. So maybe this person is with this person and this person is the ex and this person is new or vice versa. 
But either way, both of these people may have been with this person or this person is experiencing people. Like, I feel like this person is the ex and this person is new and this person wants to save this person. Because it kind of get like, motherly energy a little bit if you're looking at it, too. Because then we got the Six of Cups in reverse. And that's like, nah, I'm not really trying to go back. Because then we got the death with it. It's like, I or you didn't change. And by the looks of it, it looked like the king didn't change because... This is the person who, like I said in the beginning, they come off like, like they know how to speak a good talk, but they don't show the same stuff. They don't show it. And um, not only do they not show everything that they saying, but they also the type of person who um, you can, you can like, you can't really tell with them. They're um, unpredictable because they don't show, all, they don't show all their masks. Right? Then we have the then we have the four of cups reversed, which means it's like you're sure. You're not crying over spilled milk. You're not trying to come here and and, and want that and not get this. Like you're not even trying to work with people. Like this is you have a specific understandings for something and then we have that with the eight of pentacles in reverse like you're not working towards something a, a certain goal because you already have clarity and happiness you see that like you're not working too hard towards something that's not gonna make you happy towards getting back with this person or you're not working too hard towards the desire Towards the desire of wanting this person because you're keeping it all to yourself, right? As this person. So now I'm about to read this sex, this um, energy sexually, and we just gonna wrap this up, right? So the King of Pentacles was right here too. So now we're about to read all of these energies sexually and see how they really be getting and making each other feel, right? So the King of Pentacles, sexually, this person. This person is going to tell you the things that's going to keep you going. Like, their words really keep you going. Um, but their physical sometimes don't keep up. Like, their stamina and and maybe sometimes they don't even, like, they could tell you some shit that gets you so excited and don't even fucking do it, bro. Shit make you want to curse them out. Like, this is crazy. But they got all the words in the world. Like, come on. That's why we got the devil, like. And the four of wands. So I'm feeling like even if they get you mad and they don't always say it, they will eventually do it. Or they'll keep on talking um, and get you back into it. Like, um, But with the devil, I feel like they're going to give you enough. It, it, maybe they're going to give you enough satisfaction to stay and feel like you satisfied and you should return. Right, because when things come around, you gonna know who you dealing with. You gonna know you gonna get something, but you might not get everything. But you know what you gotta show up and give them, cause they they want you to know that part. But they but the, but understand the stability that's coming with them. Um, they might like to tie you up. They definitely like to go rounds and rounds and rounds. They want you to be strong, so they probably be effing the f out of you. Or if this is a masculine, they would like to like. That's the energy that they are in. Um, and they're very, like, um, aggressive. Um, but, they're, like, they take their time. They invest. Like, if they're aggressive, it's because they, like, planned out how they're going to be aggressive, passionate, all that stuff. But they might also be into BDSM. And they like to be the one that's, like, in charge in a bedroom. Um, or they like you to be the one or other, like... Because this is look like it's masculine with two females, it look like they like them to be on them. But then when they come to put their work in, they put their work in, they put it down. They are here for a reason. You hear? <laughs> now when it comes to this feminine energy in the middle, this person is going to let out all of their everything. So this person is going to leave the bedroom drained, more drained than the other two people in this situation. Because they're coming in to release like their burdens for the whole week for the whole day but like they can channel that and then just like orgasm 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 by the time they leave this they feeling clear they are gonna feel clear like even if they have to deal with other stuff but you know 
Um, and then they also come into that energy trying to do that for you guys. Or for, um, see, I'm saying you guys, so I feel like you got to be another energy. But you could also be this energy, you feel me? Like, I'm not, I'm not discriminating. But they're trying to clear everybody energy, all right? So then we got the Ace of, Ace of Wands in reverse. They're not going to stop until you climax. They're, like, they want climax. And they don't want it to end. They don't want it to be, they don't want to. They don't want to do a lot of work, though. Like, they don't want to do a lot of a lot of work. They might act like as if they're tired before they're actually tired, or they don't know how to do something, or that they don't know that they want that you want something done. Um, they might be more of a receiver in the bedroom than a giver. Yeah, they're not really, like, the one that's trying to, like, be in the spotlight. But they are the receiver with the Four of Pentacles revert. Four of Pentacles reverse. Four of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, like, they're not stingy with themselves. But they kind of put themselves in positions to make it seem like they don't know what to do with themselves. Um, or they don't know what to do with you. They know how to receive, but they don't know what to do with themselves. To, to You get what I'm saying? They they kind of like directions. Like, the, this is giving me a submissive type of person. They they can handle pain. Um, but, like, once again, with this justice in reverse, they don't give equal give and take in, this, in the bedroom. Um, they don't give equal give and take. They want you to dominate them. And they they like pain. But this is how they like to endure pain. It's not painful to them. The pain is not painful to them. They actually like it. Some people like the pain, like them registering it as pain. This person doesn't register it as pain. But they also... They also don't try to do that to somebody else if that's what they like. So that's why they don't want to dibble and dabble or try to do other people because they don't want to get to know if they like it or not. They just want to do what they want to do. This person got the sun and the moon. So they taking you, first of all, for a ride. This person is intuitive and they know a whole lot. Like a whole, whole lot. This person... Sexually is is always gonna have you wondering. It's always gonna have you like. It's always gonna have your mind blown. Like, did we just do that? Did that just happen? Did this just, like how? Like what? They just how the freak? This person is very feminine. Okay, so I know I said that this person like looking at this person, but this person might just be um a feminine energy. This might be a water sign. But also, like, just a feminine energy. But this person might also be a person who doesn't like to keep one person at a time. Right? Um, excuse me. And they may also have mommy issues. And it might stimulate their sexual experiences. So this is pretty spicy. Right? You see what, what I said? So, um, like, sensuality stimulates this person um and not only sensuality or um if they have mommy issues but um like duality like this person loves duality so it, like the way i said it um the setups turns this person on if this person is the person from the past and this person got out of being mistreated by this person um and this person <laughs> and this person i'm laughing because it's just like this is this is kind of cool. And this is cool because it's just like everybody has different mindsets. Um, and this person um, is in a, the relationship that they just don't know how to, you know what I mean? Then this person likes that they can go and come as they please. But they also like the fact that they could save this person and, and uh, um, like sleep with this person, but be like conspiring against this person and stuff. But also if this person is the person 
who like outside looking in and wants this person, they also just like the fact that like they're conspiring on this person and they're just like so powerful. Like this is that person. This is not that person. This is that person. Right? So in the bedroom, they're like alpha female, alpha feminine. I'ma get mine. But I'ma also make sure that everybody else in here get this too tight, right? And that's not gonna change. This person is not the type of person that um after they get there, it's like their energy change or like all the sexual experiences with them are always different. You don't get the same. <laughs> So I said that, but it came out like this. All the sexual experiences with them is always different. You don't get the same type of experiences. And even when you look forward to it, or they might, like, they're the type of person, you'd be like, yo, that session was so amazing. I want to do it again. And they could even be like, yeah. But you go, and you're going to do something completely different. And it's going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing. It's going to blow your mind. It's going to be, it's just something about it that this person and just the way they're set up, they're going to do something. Like, even if they're doing something that you did before, it's the best. They're the best. It's nobody that you're going to meet or that you've ever met that can do it like them. So if this is you, yeah. You know? See? See? Then we have the Six of Cups in reverse, right? And the Four of Cups in reverse. The four of cups is the four of cups is about being like missing out. This one is like no, it's no missing out. So like I said before, it's nobody like them, but it's no missing out. Like even even if they move on, even even if it's one on one, even if they even if it's not and it's other people involved, they make you feel like you're the goal. You're the objective. Then we got the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. They don't even try. They don't even try. It's effortless. That they just... They, they live in your mind rent-free. Like, they're, nobody else can top this person sexually maybe even like you know what i mean just in general like you don't you never met a person that was as, as, like this person this is a chosen person um um we all chosen but this this person right here mm-hmm so first of all okay and we end with this sign just pleasurable oh my god yo you it's just full fucking circle yo like you just happy. It's just an amazing experience. They leave you satisfied and they gonna leave satisfied themselves. It's not gonna stop until it satisfies. Um then we got like I said the chariot and the six of wands. So just move forward. Be a nasty. <laughs> All right, y'all. Thank you for spending your time with me. I really did enjoy doing that reading. If you enjoyed the reading, definitely drop your like, comments and all that. That was real spicy. I wasn't expecting that. Um, yeah. Well, we had the Queen of Cups in reverse, the King of Cups upright, right? That was the Queen of Cups and the Tower. With the Five of Swords, somebody being deceitful. And what's that? Five, seven. Seven of Cups. No choices. Somebody somebody losing. With the fool all right there. Somebody lose. It's a new beginning going on, y'all. So just keep going. Keep going forward. That was... See, the way I just pulled that, and we was just doing that, the dude, he might... Yo, it's a new beginning coming. Look at these two females. They, temperance. It might be that moon person taking this person... And that new beginning is right around the corner. So, wow. See you guys later.